Gone are the days of keeping your valuables in a wall safe, hidden behind a painting. Today's super rich love technology, secret keypads, and walls of spyglass. And when they're hiding a seven-figure watch collection, there are some very luxurious ways to do it. As people's collections grow, they don't know where to put their watches and where to store them securely. And Greg Simonian should know, he's the guy who keeps West Time ticking in West Hollywood. He's been selling expensive watches to super rich collectors for years. How expensive? Well, this $105,000 price tag is a bargain compared to this rare $740,000 Audemars Piaget. I'd say the majority of the clients have a watch collection that's well over a million dollars. So this is a truly unique way to display your collection. And when you spend that much on watches, you don't blink at the price of this Boobin and Zorwig collector cabinet. This would cost around $350,000. 350 grand, and it could take nine months to get it. They're made in Austria, and the company only produces around 70 a year. It's customizable, so it can go up as high as a client wants it to. You know, in the past, we've done um, this portion of it wrapped in an alligator. They sell more secure units, too. Behind this mirror is a secret safe designed to be like a personal valet for your closet. What we have here is watch winders, drawers for other valuables, and then on the bottom here, is an additional safe. So why all the spinning watches? Well, high-end automatic watches don't run on batteries. They're actually powered by the motion of the wearer's wrist. And if they don't get worn, they'll stop ticking. So that's the purpose of a watch winder, to keep the watch running and to keep the watch running on time. This mini vault holds and winds just one watch. It's small enough to fit on a desk, but costs as much as a new car. The retail price on the Colosimo by Dotling is $33,000. Sounds crazy until you realize this thing is completely handmade of German steel. And it's an exact replica of an old U.S. bank safe, which explains how it got its name. It's named after a U.S. criminal who was known for breaking into ink safes. It only weighs about 60 pounds, so Colosimo could have just walked away with this one. Um, it's really just a unique way to store something that's precious to you. Speaking of breaking into safes, we never expected the guy who runs this place to admit this. Even the most secure safe in the world can be broken into with a blowtorch in 90 minutes. The idea behind the safe is really to slow somebody down. In other words, no matter how much they spend on a safe in here, his clients are really just buying time. The idea is really to have other security systems around it and to delay the process so that nobody has 90 minutes with your safe.